This video is sponsored by Filmora Pro. This is the preview template, and you can free download it from the description link. Now let's see how to make this text effect. First let's create a space background. To do this, create a new plane, and name this one space. And drag this plane on the timeline. Put a fractal noise effects on it. The fractal noise effect comes with some really neat presets, including a Starfield one, which we'll be using our background. Let's go to import titles and select the relatively plain looking title to start out. Select the title, then click on import. Drag this title over the space background. Let's click on edit text one and type your title. Click on text two and delete the second title. Click text one animation and change the animation to cinema style. Set revel length to 22% and conceal length to 0%. Let's center our main text by going to text one transform and adjusting the position. We want to animate the scale of this title by going to scale and select the keyframe at the start and setting one just over two seconds in. We'll set our second keyframe to 80% and turn it into a smooth in keyframe. Now going to the value graph and pulling this level further to the left. Under the text panel, change the font to a nice impactful font like this one. Let's take a look at that. Let's add a subtitle, select the text tool and type your subtitle text. For this subtitle, choose a shorter font and increase the kerning a bit. Let's set the subtitle by clicking the Move tool. Let's animate the subtitle by scale. Disconnect the X and Y scale value. We'll set two keyframes. And second one to smooth in. And the first keyframe X scale value set to 80%. We need to fix our anchor point to be in the center. And in the layout panel, recenter everything. Now let's take a look. It's really looking nice. Let's also fade this title in by animating its opacity. Let's bring the subtitle back a little bit. So now we have our title sequence animated. Let's liven up the image a bit with a flare. To do this, create a new black plane and name this one flare. Let's drag it onto a track of our current clips. And under the clip properties, set the blend mode to screen. Next let's add a light flares effect. And find the type of flare you want. I'll choose Anamorphic Enterprise. And then I will experiment with the settings a little bit more to get just the right look. There we go. Let's animate the flare to follow E. By going to the hotspot position and create a keyframe from where you want it come in and another keyframe for when the title stops moving with the flyer positioned at the top of the E. Next let's animate the intensity of the flyer by setting three keyframes. With the middle being nice and bright the start and end keyframe set to zero. Let's smooth the middle keyframe and smooth in the last keyframe. There we go, we have created a cinematic title animation completely in Filmora Pro. Now let's see how to export it. Click on export and select contents. And select the video resolution, I will choose YouTube 1080p HD. Now select the output location and type a name of your title. Then just click on start exporting button. As you can see, it's exporting. Done. Now let's see the animation. Thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe.